I'm kind of curious, um, what, at what point did that interview sort of happen you, in the process, and how were you involved with sort of saying this is something to include in the film or not include in the film? It was in, we were looking, I, I, I was looking at the cut with him, and I think Diane, the producer, if I remember correctly, and it was like he had already put that scene in there, but it was like, oh, there's more, okay. you know, behind that scene. And so we talked about that a little bit. Um, but it, you know, he, because his early cut of the film was kind of about him. It was about Zach and Kier and Nina and some of his other friends played, you know, a, a role in it. But it was very much about being in Rockford. So it had changed already from this survey film to something that was going to be more like a character driven thing about these particular people in a particular place. Um, and beyond just particular people in a particular place, his friends, yeah. and then ultimately him. So this, yeah. is, this is one of those films where it's, it's, um, it's a very personal story, and um, I'm guessing that his involvement in the story, I mean, even in that little scene, you hear the beginning of him sort of connecting with, ah, I'm a part of this story too, this is my, this is about me as well. But I'm guessing it took a while for him to really sort of decide he was going to be a part of the film. Can you talk a little bit about how that process he, was? I think he struggled with it. You know, it took a while for him to come to terms with the fact that he was going to have to become a major character. And then eventually he realized he's going to have to try and talk to his mother, which was a big uh, bridge to cross. Uh, but I think once he sort of started down that path, there was no turning back. Um, you know, he, I, I don't think he ever had doubts about that. I've worked with other filmmakers where it's a very personal film, where it has gotten so heavy that they have been like, uh, can I turn around here? Can I get out of this? I mean, Stevie is an example where Steve, there were times when Steve was just like, I don't think we should be making this movie. You know, he wanted to give up. And so it's, it's complicated when it's that personal. The thing that I think is, for me, really lands in, in mining the gap is that Bing is in his movie because he belongs in his movie, because their story is his story, and he couldn't tell it without risking and revealing something about himself. I think sometimes I see films where I feel it's a little bit self-indulgent, where you sort of feel like the filmmaker is more interested in themselves and telling you about them than the people who are around them who sometimes are more interesting. And so it's a, it's a complicated thing to get right. And I think being difficult as it was, and as much of a journey as it was, he got it right. 